This video of Nollywood actor Hanks Anuku roaming on the streets of Asaba trended yesterday. Um, Sean George came out to debunk the news with a video suggesting that Hanks Anuku is perfectly doing fine. Nothing is wrong with him. Even though so many people came to testify that something is really, really wrong with him, which needs to be attended to urgently before it gets out of hands. However, Sean George colleagues, Nollywood actresses, has come out to say otherwise, proving Sean George wrong. But my big question is, why does she always like covering up the truth? This is coming from Ada Muliki. I guess you all know her. She's a well-known female um, actress. She said, please, you all Nollywood peeps should stop with the lies when you know the truth. He isn't okay, so let him get help now that the world knows. Stop with the cover-up. If it was your blood, you would have helped. But now that the world is about to find out the truth, you, you all try to hide it. Hank isn't okay, so let's allow him get help now before it's too late. And this is coming from Iheme Nancy. She said, I have been trying to keep calm and mind my business since yesterday but my conscience wouldn't let me this disturbing video of legendary uncle hanks anuku surfaced on internet which is 100 percent true which is 100 percent his reality at shan george films came out to debunk it instead of letting him get the help he needs at last instead of allowing people to help him you concealed a truth why now Hong Kong Hank's condition is not a secret to any Asaba based actor neither is it to the most Asaba resident as most people have been seeing him in different sorry have seen him in different odd locations in abnormal states personally I have had an encounter with him at Fourth Side Bar where I normally buy fish pepper soup whenever i'm in asaba this incident happened last month on the 27th of october where he almost hmm, beat me up for no reason he said some hurting words to me and as ujunwa and neneji we but we kept calm because he wasn't himself from that day i prayed he could get help and finally yesterday that god was about to answer that prayer he stopped it for reasons best known to you Drinking to uh, walking around Asaba is not new. Please, this post is to plead to all well-meaning Nigerians. Hanks Anuku needs help. And this is the video she made with the Hanks Anuku <laughs> to cover up the truth. But this Shanjoje, I don't know. You guys recall during the time of um, Apostle John Suleiman and Halima Abubakar, the way Halima dragged her, dragged her, because of trying to cover up the truth. You know, some people did not did not believe Halima Mubaka. But at this point, eh, at this point, with all this are debunky, debunker, debunkers, eh, trying to cover up the truth. I strongly believe in what Abubaka is saying, you know. Why is she always trying to cover up the truth? And she's a mother. What will she stand to gain? What is her motive behind all this? In fact, may we never jam someone, either friends, family members, relatives, that will stand as a stumbling block on the day our helpers we want to locate us in Jesus' name. Can somebody at the back shout hallelujah? Yes, let's seriously. This is the prayers most people, all of us need to be praying every day. Because at this point, Shan George is, is just, in fact, she's a stumbling block to Hanks Anuku. Give him the help he needs. No. A lot of people that want to help him to help him. No. Is she trying to cover up Nollywood shame? Of course, we all know that Nollywood does not like each other. You see, all these Nollywood girls, all this bling bling, all this things that... No, they don't like each other at all. There's no love among them. That is why you see every time one sickness to another, one problem to another, instead of them to gather around, you know, form a formidable force and render help to that person that needs that help at that particular point in time without public knowing it, 
you will see them coming out to beg for phones from the public when they have ADN, a whole Nollywood. It's a big shame. So she tries to cover up their shame. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. What she try- it's all in the public. So the least she would have done is allow people to help him. 1,000, 2,000, no amount of money they contribute for um, Hans Sanuku will be too much to get him the help he need at this point in time before they will be quick to rush to Instagram, social media to type RYP. Now that he's alive, why don't, in fact, I don't understand some people's mentality. And some people are asking about Hans Anuku's family. I don't know about his family. I've not even come across any article regarding to his family members you know, his biography, all I know about him is he's um, a Nollywood actor. As anything that concerns his family, I don't know. I don't know if they have actually rendered the help to him. And, you know, two things are involved in this life. Oh, someone you are trying to help is a person also helping himself. Maybe they have tried their best to give him the help that he needs. And ah, they have seen that this one, no one changed you. He doesn't want to change from his old ways. You know, this is an addiction. This thing is an addiction. What's addicted to read? Ah, it is by the special grace of God for that person to drop that habit. So they might be, they, they might have done their best, but since they're not seeing any improvement, and most of them must have had their own families they care for. Ah, so that is my own thing, you know. That's my own thing. But that one no me say they could just desert him just like that. Blood is thicker than water. At least they should have keep on doing their best, you know, trying their best to see that. Uh-uh, it's a shameful thing, oh, shameful thing. Ah, I see your brother for so so place. In they do this, in they do that. Uh-uh, that one. Anyway, like I said, it depends on the person you are helping. Furthermore, now that it has gotten to the public, I believe one or two, three, but I love Nigerians. You see Nigerians, eh? Hey, they are, we, are, we are always our brother's keeper. Like, once this thing does, just, as this thing just leak online like this, people will literally, really gather around to give him the help that he needs but the big question is will he cooperate will he cooperate don't be surprised that this thing my instinct is telling me might or may actually turn out to be true maybe after giving him the help that he needs and it will turn out to be that ah this person this person actually no one no one help in fact and it will be very very disappointing to nigerians that have gathered themselves you know took it upon themselves to help him but I'm just praying for a better change. This guy, Hans Sanuku, those days now, all of us enjoy this guy. They're doing that time now. My childhood memories. I'm not going to forget them. Lie, lie. Well, with that being said, that brings me to the end of this video. Please and please subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you're watching for the first time, this is Ladly Woman on Court. On this channel, we react, analyze, we give trending gist, celebrity news, true crime, and true crime stories. You are most welcome. Thank you for tuning in. And to my returning subscribers, of course, you all know that this video can never ever be complete without me appreciating you all for tuning in, for watching, commenting, liking, sharing. Thank you all. I had to plenty. You all know I love you guys to the moon and back. Thank you for watching and stay with me up to this moment as I'm signing for my next one. Peace out. I love you all. Game Messiano.